happy Tuesday, kindergarten friends. Back for more math today. Make sure you have your Go Math book and a pencil, and we're going to look at lesson 2.5 today. Okay, so we are looking at how can you use counting strategies to compare sets of objects, okay? So we're going to be looking for um, the amount of the different objects, and then we're going to compare those two groups. So the first one, it says, look at the sets of objects, count how many objects in each group, each set, write the number, compare the numbers, and tell a friend which number is greater, which one is less, okay? So what we're going to do is we're going to comp first count each of the sets. For the counts, we have one, two, three, four, five, okay? So we have five cows, slide down, curve it around, and give it a hat. And then let's see how many chickens we have. We have one, two, three. Okay, curve it around and around again. Okay, which one is greater? Which one is more? Okay, we're gonna circle the number that is greater. And five is greater than three. So go ahead and circle five. And then which one is smaller? Which one is less than? Okay, it is the chickens and it is three. So go ahead and cross the number out for me. Okay, so we circle the bigger number and we crossed out the smaller number. Okay, wonderful. Let's go to the next page. And for these, we're gonna circle the greater number, okay? So first we're gonna see how many in each set. So how many lambs, okay, or sheep, ready? One, two. Two sheep and how many turtles? One, two, three. Okay, so which one is bigger? Which one is more? Okay, look, is two more or is three more? Three is more, so go ahead and circle the number three. Okay, down here we have some chicks, like Easter chicks, okay? We have one, two, three. Curve it around and around again. And we have turkeys, like Thanksgiving turkeys. And how many? Just one. Nice straight down one. Okay, so let's look at the sets. We have three chicks and one turkey. Which one has more? Okay, the chicks do. So go ahead and circle the three for the greater number. Next, we have goats and puppy dogs. So let's look at the goats first to see how many we have. We have one, two, three, four, five. Slide down, curve it around, and give it a hat. And then how many puppy dogs? Let's see. One, two, three, four. Slide down, slide to the right, cut it in two. And which one is more? Is five more or is four more? Five is more, so go ahead and circle it. You're doing a great job today, boys and girls. Remember, if you need to stop and pause, go ahead and do that. You don't need to go as fast as Miss Fury. So for this side, we're still comparing, but we're gonna circle the number that is less, okay? So first we have a horse, and then we have some ducks. So how many horses? Just one. So go ahead and slide down for number one. And then how many ducks? Let's count. One, two. Curve it around and slide to the right. Okay, remember, we're not looking for the bigger number. We're looking for the smaller number. So which one's smaller, one or two? One. Go ahead and circle it. Okay, next we have kitty cats and we have owls. Okay, let's count the kitty cats first. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, slide down, curve it around, give it a hat. And how many owls? One, two, three, four. Four owls. These are bigger groups. Slide down, slide to the right, cut it in two. And which one is smaller? Is it the cats or the owls? It's the owls. Go ahead and circle the owls. The number four for the four owls. Next we have little deers and mice. So we have one, two, three deers. Curved around and around again for three. And how many mice? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five. Slide down, curve it around, and give it a hat. And which one is smaller? Which one is the less than group? Okay, so three is less than five, so we're gonna circle three, the smaller number. Okay, you did a great job today, boys and girls, for math. You need to make sure you have 105, 106, and 107 done. Those are the three pages Miss Beery did with you today. If you'd like to, you can do 108, 109, and 110 for some extra work, okay? But you don't have to do that. I will see you tomorrow for some more math, and we're going to jump into Chapter 3 tomorrow. 
three. We've already gotten through chapter one, chapter two. Moving on to chapter three. We're making some moves in kindergarten. Have a great day, and I will see you tomorrow, friends. Bye.